we're excited to announce that someone from the community has also taken the opportunity to create their own model manager class. BioDigital, an interactive 3D software platform for anatomy visualization, has provided the ORK BioDigital model manager class so that their already powerful iOS SDK can now be integrated easily into any research kit project. Some of their features includes presenting custom models created via the admin portal, programmatically adding labels, colors, and annotations to any model loaded within your app. And since all of BioDigital models are loaded via the web, you can dynamically add new models to your project without having to update any code. Let's see a couple examples in action. In the first example, we use an instruction step to inform the user that we'll present an interactive human model. This could be used in many situations that most of us have experienced, such as visiting a physical therapy clinic or an orthopedic physician's office, where you're usually given a piece of paper to describe your pain or circle the area on some kind of picture. Now we can get rid of paper and make the experience much better. As you see here, we've loaded our model while also being presented with a card that contains useful information that can be updated via BioDigital's admin portal or their SDK. Users can also interact with the model so that they can reach and view the exact areas of interest. After clicking on the muscle where pain has been experienced, we're also presented with a label that can give us even more information on that specific organ. This can be updated via BioDigital's admin portal or locally through their SDK. In the next example, we imagine a scenario where a patient has visited a hospital for chest pain. After receiving a CT scan, the physician would like to give a visual to show the patient the exact arteries that are experiencing blockages. To do this, we'll present an interactive 3D human heart model with dynamically added annotations to specific coronary arteries, all done directly through BioDigital Model Manager class. As you can see here, we presented our heart model along with another car view for additional information. The user can then interact with the heart model and select the programmatically added annotations to find more information on the severity of each individual blockage. Let's take a look at the code to present the animated heart model. After importing research kit and human kit, which is provided by BioDigital, we first initialize ORK BioDigital Model Manager instance. Then we set a couple of properties that were inherited from the ORK 3D Model Manager class, such as highlight color and identifiers of objects to highlight. Then we focus on some properties and instance methods added by BioDigital, such as identifiers of objects to hide, the load method, where we pass in the ID of the model we want to present, in this case, the heart model, and the annotate method, where we pass in the identifier of the object we want to annotate, in this case, the right coronary artery. After setting the title and text, the last thing we have to do is initialize the ORK 3D model step and pass in the BioDigital model manager created above. To find out more information about BioDigital and their SDK, visit their GitHub page seen here.